Good morning, sports racers. I'm on the fifth moon of Yavin, and you're watching the show with Zay Frank. <laughs> Yavin, like in Star Wars? It's, it's another travel day, and I had to wake up really early. I don't feel like doing it today. Look at me. What are you? Nothing. Come on, say it. I'm a pretty princess. What? I'm a pretty princess. I'm a pretty princess. Pretty princess, cape and rose, macho men not included. I'm a pretty princess. I have to check out today. Some people get confused on what the proper etiquette is when you check out of a hotel room. Try to be considerate of the guests that are going to occupy the room after you. For example, I touched this brand new roll of toilet paper. To be considerate, I wrote, I touched this on the inside of each sheet that I touched. Don't skimp, put it back just the way you found it. Mmm, hotel corners. Remember, a decorator took time to decorate the room. It can be nice to leave evidence that you paused for a second to admire the artwork. If you find something out of place, feel free to respect the designer's original intentions. Some inconsiderate guests probably moved these toilet gnomes. All better. As for the books, remember the designer chose those too. I like to leave little book reviews so that they can tell that I noticed. Sometimes I leave criticism too, but if you do, make sure that whatever you're criticizing isn't your fault. If you can, try and find little ways to give something back and to show that you understand the aesthetic of the hotel. If you do, try and be a little bit creative. Sure, money's okay, but putting a little extra effort in can really make someone's day. You should always leave a gratuity and make sure that it's proportionate to the length of your stay. But whatever you do, make sure it's in an obvious place. If you don't, it may go unnoticed and get thrown away. Blah, 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 blah.